Hey y'all, it's your girl Empress Cheryl here to do an Afucus love reading. Okay, so Afucus or Ether sign, the only one Afucus, you by yourself in this reading. Okay, so um, this will be a blackout reading, so you will not see anything. Okay, we're using the Tarot of the Divine to get the energy around the love life for those who resonate with the sign of a fucus okay so let's get into it get into your messages spirit what do you have for those who resonate with the sign of a fucus okay so we got two cards that came out we have this strength card here and this king of coins which is king of pentacles i'm getting more so like you're at maybe either you're trying to hold on to something and create some type of um stability or you're trying to like remain I'm I'm also getting like remain strong or something like that. Like you're trying to remain strong. Like take this how it resonates um for you. But we have this strength card here where this woman is like, you know, tussling with this um a lion with the crocodile mouth or whatever but it's like coming out with this king of coins so it's like are you, are you in a energy of trying to tame something or trying to tame yourself trying to hold something down trying to control some type of situation here um where you feel like it's going to provide some type of stability, some type of security. It's like I'm getting the sense of wanting to hold on to something that you feel like will be um, secure, you know, or hold on to something that you feel like could, um, you know, could last a while or could be some type of, you know, lead to some type of, you know, um, potential situation let's see what else y'all have a few kids we have the magician like i'm getting more so like something you feel like you've manifested something you feel like something has come into being you feel like you manifested something and it's like you're wanting to hold on to it you're wanting to hold on to your manifestation or are you either in the process because this woman still has her wand up so you could just very well still be in the process of manifesting. You know what I'm saying? Still in the process of wanting to call in a stable situation. Maybe you're trying to hold back certain desires so that you can manifest some type of secure, stable situation here. Because this magician does definitely still have her wand up. This five of swords came out um but it came out like sideways like um in crossing and i'm getting more so like you're likely in conflict or coming out of conflict um in regards to a situation or you're understanding that there is some type of um competition i'm, I'm really more so getting conflict though from this particular five of wands but i'm getting more so conflict in regards to your manifestations maybe like are you clear on what it is that you want to manifest you know what i'm saying like is 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 that what you're in conflict about or are you not sure whether you're still in the process of manifesting or or that you have already or you know what i'm saying or if what is in front of you is something that you have already something that you already manifested like i'm just getting like this mindset of like 
not being sure about your manifestation um, in regards to love. Let's see what else comes out for you. Pucus. What's going on, Pucus? Love life for a Pucus. What's going on, Spirit Love messages? We have the Death card here, okay? So, with this Death card, like, I'm getting some transforming, transformational energy here, okay? So, it's like, you're trying to figure out, but this is this is a card like with with the woman trying to like pull back the curtain. So I'm getting more so okay. So you know what I got here? Was it like is this the one type situation? Is this it? Like is this, you know what I'm saying? Is is am I finally gonna see, you know what I'm saying? Like, am I finally going to see who this person is like am i finally going to um know or understand or you know what i'm saying like again is this it you know what i'm saying like can i pull down this curtain is you know what i'm saying is is this the final you know what's that what's the thing when they when they close the curtain is this the final curtain call or whatever i don't know this curtain is sticking out you know what i'm saying for me in this picture and i know y'all can't see it so oops but that's kind of what I'm getting. It's like you're there's some transformation, there's some changes going on in your energy, in your energy in regards to love. And it's like it's some changes that you have brought about, but it's like it's still this unclear, unsure, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like trying to figure out what's what okay what's going on with a few kids what's going on love life of a few kids we got the judgment card here okay so all right first of all y'all got four major arcanas already out of six cards that came out but this judgment card here again is, is like you're in this energy of is this where I make a decision? Is this it? Is this the direction that I am supposed to go? Like you're not clear on if, if you know what I'm getting, like you're not clear on if this is what God wants you to do. You know what I'm saying? Like you're not sure if this is something sent from the divine, if you're still waiting on you know what i'm saying on 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 your time like you know what i'm saying like it's just a energy of like you looking to god for confirmation you know what i'm saying like you're looking to the most high you're looking to spirit you're looking to the divine like hey is this it like i wish y'all could see this picture now i'm mad that it's like blacked out but it's like you're looking for like, hey, are you right here? <laughs> like in this picture, this person is like leaning over. Um, so it's like you're really just trying to in this energy of like you're trying to be sure, like you're trying to make sure whatever step you take right now is like that is something from the divine. It is something that is divinely orchestrated, something that is manifested into your life from spirit now what i am getting is since you have four major arcana cards like this is some you know what i'm saying like spirit is heavy in your love life i can confirm that you know what i'm saying with with these cards here it's like spirit is really heavy in your love life but spirit is not going to make any decisions for you so that <laughs> okay but let's see if we can get like a final Oh, the final card that came out was this Five of Swords. This Five of Swords came out, okay? So it's like, are you going to be in this? Oh, but the Two of Cups is at the bottom of the deck, okay? So with this Five of Swords, like I'm getting like, there's an energy of like someone. Okay, so the story, this is like, uh, what are their names? Well, I can't remember their names, but it's like the, um, 
Egyptian tale? Is it like, oh man, I don't want to say it and mess it up, but it's like Osiris and you know the story where like the man's woman got took from him or or whatever. Like I'm just getting that energy here. Like you might have got snatched or swiped or you know what I'm saying or or you're in a, a situation where you like either someone took you know what I'm saying either you, like you're feeling like someone took your person or you missed out or you know what I'm saying like some there was some type of missed opportunity or some type of loss or something like that that you or trying to prevent, or you're trying, you know what I'm saying, um, not to feel, or you're trying to recover from, or something like that. But with this two of cups at the bottom of the deck, what I'm getting is, at the end of the day, you are going to be in your happy-go-lucky two of cups, equal partnership and connection. Okay, so, you know, what I'm saying even though you are in this worry energy and you're, you know, what I'm saying you're trying to figure out what to do. You're trying to make sure you don't make a mistake. You're trying to make sure you don't make the wrong move. I'm getting at the end of the day, regardless, either way, you are going to have your two of cups situation. So that's something for you to ponder on. It's something for you to accept and embrace. Um, and understand that spirit is involved in your love life. All right. So that's the message for y'all. Y'all take care and have a jazzy day.